The funny thing about overwhelm is you could easily be overwhelmed and not even know it. Overwhelm has a weird way of creeping into our lives and just showing up. How do you know when you're overwhelmed? There's a few different signs. One is you're overdoing the things that make you feel good when you feel bad. So what's your go-to when you feel bad? What's your go-to when you kind of stress out? Is it more food, more work, more screen time? Are you a little shorter on the fuse level with emotions and other people? Are you drinking more than you usually do? That that more thing. What do you do when you feel bad to make you feel better? If you're in that every day, you might go, hmm, maybe I'm overwhelmed. The other one is we avoid, procrastinate. You may have a list of four things to do and you can't even get through two of them. Sleeping more, TV, zoning out, checking out. What day is it today? So we go to those two places when we're overwhelmed. And overwhelmed, we want to blame everything on the outside. It's this person, it's this situation that's making me stressed out. You know what? If a general and I were on the battlefield, he'd be cool as a cucumber. And me? I'd be freaking out. That's not my world. I don't understand battlefield. I don't understand wartime strategy the way he will. So I'm glad that he's there, but I don't want to be there. So in this situation, I feel like a general because I've, I've been through so much worse than what we're going through right now. People don't know this, but I lived on an island a private island for 10 long years. And during that time, I developed a skill set of coping. I went through five hurricanes and I was married to an angry man. No fun. But I was able to survive. I was able to be who I truly am. I was able to be authentic. And I just want to share because I'm, I'm hearing more and more the need to connect to ground, to get real with ourselves about what we're going through. Not talking about what's going on outside, but overwhelm is the inability to process information inside, our emotions inside. Who we are, where do we stand, what's our references in life. So if that's making sense to you, then I've put a together a plan for a class and it's called Overwhelm to Confident. So no matter what's happening on the outside, you can have a sense of a semblance, groundedness, clarity, ability to make wise decisions without reaching and avoiding. If you want more information, just click the link and give me a call, text message me. I'd love to help you. I'd love to do this course with you. And I want what's best for you. I want to support you in becoming your best self, your strongest self, your most vibrant self in spite of anything that's happening around you. Thank you.